guys, and uh, good afternoon to you all and welcome back to our uh, regional uh, qualifiers. This time we're gonna have Chinese region and the uh, lower bracket pa rin yung kinakover kung ang series ay tayo. Mumbling sounds. But anyway, nandito pa rin naman tayo for our lower bracket. So another best of three this time around we're gonna have Team Bright against Team Aster. So um... Team Aster nilaglag sila yesterday na extreme uh, gaming. Meanwhile, Team Bright nilaglag sila nung uh, unang araw against yeah, Azure Day. Pero so far, kasi sa mga games na napapanood ko previously on this qualifier, malakas naman yung Team Bright. I mean, nakaisa naman sila against Azure Day, one of the best teams for China region. And I think, meron naman silang chance against Team Aster. Pero Team Aster pa rin kasi itong pinag-uusapan natin. Pakbahan talaga yun ang yari to for our China region. But anyway, for Team Bright, we're gonna have Ember Spirit, Mirana, and Silence Hermita. For Team Master, we're gonna have the Blue Master, Invoker, and Lion. So, uh, sa Team Bright, nakita mo naman agad yung uh, combination under heroes. You have Ember together with Mirana. So, uh, sitting chains with a follow up arrow. Do you even have the Silencer? So, um. Para at least, di ba, meron silang pampatay ng Brewmaster even though we don't have the solid disable. Hindi naman ganun ka-reliable yung chains together with arrow pero yung global silence. That's one way to deal with the Brewmaster and we're gonna have Doom on the fourth pick. You, you really gotta pick a hero. Yung si Doom yung isa sa mga heroes na nanerf talaga dispatch. Yung hindi na namin um, yung items. You, you better pick your hero. Five Doom. seconds. Well, uh, wala ka nga lang healing dyan. Yun yung maganda. Parang pinipick na lang yung Doom ngayon kapag meron talaga silang kinakounter out na heroes like more fleeing Slark, yung mga Haskar, ganun. Pero for this team, wala namang ganun klaseng hero for Team Master. But still, nakakatakot pa rin naman yung Global Science together with the Doom. And uh, for Team Master, uh, looking for the fourth pick this time. Team ban. Well, Team Master will go for Terror Blade on the fourth pick. So, what Terror Blade, Natural Mantis style builder, don't care about the global silence. Even your chains can be held by the Manta. So, uh, okay, naman yung Terror Blade. Yun nga lang, di ba, Team Master, you have Terror Blade uh, together with Team Master. Hero, Press meron long cooldown on their spells. But I think in terms of cleaning, malas naman yung heroes yung Team Master. So, Team Bright, we're just looking for the receive in hero and for Team Master. Kulang pa sila ng post 5 or post 4. Depende, pero tingin ko post 4 lion na yata to. So, any other saving heroes na ayaw kalaban? Ang Terror Blade, we still have, yeah, Terror, I mean, uh, Faces Void will be banned out. We still have the Illusion Heroes. Kaso, Ooh, yun nga lang, di ba? Parang, ang pangit na ng mga Illusion Heroes ngayon. Andali lang nila makounter out, eh. Like Rachel and Shiva, it's not also good against Voodoo Master with the Blue Panda na meron pang dispel ng illusions. And ayun lang naman yung ayaw kalaban ng Terror Blade. Oh, Hi, Kia Quiz is here. Maganda nga hapon sa inyo lahat, guys. Mag-isa muna ako ngayon kasi busy um, squad. You, you, you better pick your hero. Nagpaalam Five naman siya. Wala, pasokan na kasi next week. Kailangan niyang mabili oh, muna yung mga guys. Hey. <laughs> So, Clockwork and Elder Titan remove, and for Team Master, ano pa bang okay na hero for Team Bright? Oh, man. Parang tanggal naman na rin yung mga ayaw, kalaban ng Terror Blade. Yeah, five seconds left now. Well, aside from Illusion Heroes, meron pa tayong Draw Ranger. I think isa rin yun sa weakness ng Terror Blade. Come on, Dire Team, pick it, pick it good. Uh, 
Well, uh, Phantom Lancer removed for Team Aster, so support hero. Ano pa bang ako dito for Aster? Radiant team pick! Never mind, I'll go for Disruptor on the last pick, so um... Another hero with huge control for Team Aster. That's one way to cast Chamber Spirit. Yun yung medyo laki, hindi man actually laki. Meron pala tayong line dito for Team Aster. But at least we have the decent follow-up. We still have the silence for Team Aster. Uh, 10 seconds to pick your hero, you moron. And uh, for Team Tight, ano pa bang okay na safe lane? Draw Ranger na lang naiisip ko. Pero against this Raptor... Glimps? Parang yung Glimps lang naman yung kalaban ng Draw Ranger. Parang okay lang. Wala namang heroes talaga na lumalapit or tumatalon on the backlines for Team Master. So I think Draw Ranger would work out fine for them. Anti-mage. Choose your hero. Well, team right with the last bit to go for anti-mage, so I'm not sure about this one. I mean, anti-mage, okay naman siya for this game, like, to deal with the invoker, you're up against heroes na maraming, uh, I mean, na malaki yung mana pool. So, malaki, malaki naman yung magiging damage ng mana void. And it's okay then uh, to lean against the blue master, pero anti-mage, it takes a lot of time bago siya mag-online. Parang ang passive today bigla ng heroes ng team, right? Like, you have AM together with two. But I'm not sure if magmamidas pa dito si Irving, pero that might be the case this week. Parang yung gagalo lang talaga on the map is yung Ember together with Mirana and uh, Silencer. Pero anti-mage against Terrorblade. Isang reflection mo lang to, though nagmamanta style naman din yung AM. Kaya parang okay lang din. Pero for Terrorblade, parang he doesn't care about his mana. Kahit na sabihin meron tayong anti-mage. As long as now, commit me yung uh, metamorphosis, parang that's it for the you can just go for the right clicks. And isang butterfly lang naman to. For the bleed, hindi naman, I mean, uh, hindi naman siya parang ina-itemize lagi for anti-mage yung uh, MKB. So I think by the time magkaroon ng early butterfly for the bleed, you can also counter out the Ember Spirit you can easily touch out the uh, side of Fist. Na parang siguro yung uh, draft ng Team Bright, parang mas nagre-realize sila on their lead. Kaya kung abot man tayo ng late game, team ko meron naman silang chance with the AM and Doom. Well, all depends pa rin naman for our leaning phase, pero tingnan natin kung magkakaroon pa tayo ng early scrimmage for this first, I mean, uh, for the boss. Follow my lead! I'll give them a drubbing they'll not soon forget. Sa rin siya medyo confusing para sa akin is paano ba gumagana yung in- I mean, against Ember Spirit, yung before the patch, yung laging ginagawa nila, di ba, is yung Quaspex. So, with the Ember, you can easily dispel the Flame Guard. Quaspex, para rin makapag-rotate uh, ka on the side lanes. So, this time, he has one point on the Exhort. So, Sun Strike, Sun Strike pa. Yung parang nga, so, I mean, decent naman yung Sun Strike this game. Kaya naman tayong setup, you have the line to set things up. And easily burst someone out. Oh, Morty! Oh, it's about to start, Morty. Well, reflection over the three heroes and now stun connects on to UV. We have to block for the follow up. They had the slow and now glimpse. And this might be the first blood we had to body block and Rex and one more is all they need oh, and kill. Will be given to Sumir to a first blood for the invoker. Malaki ng bagay. Malaki ng for Sumir. I think he's going for double bracer. Yun yun naka. Yun sa kanya yun. And yung maganda sa Saiyan Warrior, yun, ito na siyang universal hero. So you can just go for stats item. Meanwhile, 
on the bottom lane, we're gonna have Brewmaster together with Lion against Silencer and anti -Mage. So, parang, hindi rin naman ideal yung kasama ni uh, anti -Mage for this team. Like, you're dealing together with Silencer, wala ka nung stun. So, parang hindi rin naman pwede mag-assim masyado sa team yung anti -Mage, uh, burn out sa mana for the Brewmaster. Parang more on dealing lang yung uh, pwede mangyari dito for team fights. Well, Metamorphosis is committed on the top lane, we still have the glimpse for the Destructor. So, pwede naman sila mag-try para stun and hex over to the anti-mage. He had to drunk in his thunderclap and right clicks against the E. And he doesn't have to blink in 4 seconds, so that was huge for the master for the XSS goes down as well. But there's no XP and gold given to the uh, anti-mage. So, uh, worth it pa rin naman yun for the master. Now what denied? Okay, ngayon na lang ulit tayo nagkaroon ng pause sa game Pero Gia agad Never refuse gold given Well, onto the top lane, Imitator is in big trouble. We still have the reflection and right clicks from his own, and the Imitator goes down. So, 1 T at almost 4 minutes. Well, good start for Team Master. Metamorphosis is still on cooldown for 50 seconds, so you're being. No, I'm not sure problem this time. Tis non cupatory. So, a quasi exert na nga talaga yung gagawin dito ni Sumil. So, uh, more on farming yung pwede mong approach pag kaganda yung ginagawa na ito. I think Midas naman yung magiging item niya. So, mukhang balak lang din nilang sabihin sa farm. Dito yung team, right? Oo, dire! You gotta fortify them their structures. Good work. Fell amp and fell life. Well, all to the top lane, Metamorphosis used by Muni. We have the double star storm and Muni still standing on his ground to mill with the sun. So, connecting onto Irving, but Muni goes down first. Um, one for one trade off on the top lane, but another kill for our mid invoker. Well, fresh Metamorphosis used for Muni, so you still need to wait out two minutes. So, I'm going to go to the main lane. Dito na, sir. On to the bottom lane, Exorcist is in big trouble. They still have the curse. The stew is there, and uh, Anthem is trying to look for the Blue Master, but he's just gonna run away. We have the Healing Lotus and that Healing Self. So, I'm going to go back to lane. No problem for the Blue Master. Having trouble seeing straight. Well, 
But power rune on the top lane simi regen rune over the ember spirit. So, meron naman siyang one point for Siren Chase. Pwede naman sila mag-try ng Siren Chase into arrow combination. Well, Hex over to Haka and Blink out lang for the anti-mage. Sorry agad. Yung lion. Imba strength now rekindled. Oh jeez, Radiant's courier just got killed! Well, wisdom rune. Denied. We have two heroes here for Team Bright. So, uh, Disruptor is in big trouble. Imitator is already on the way. Starstorm still has the arrow for the follow-up. And arrow will be used early on. So, wisdom rune will still be taken by the two supports of Team Aster. But it's not just that it's given. This time is cut. Of course, Earth level 3 still trying to run away. As the Fairy Fire, so he's just trying to create some space. Oh, I'm gonna put it in the into the hands of your beings. So, um, nako na man din tayo na expedient kay papano for a team, right? Money changes. Isa pang bounty boss. Nakalimutan ni Kaka. <laughs> o hindi yata napansin. Well, Gleams over the year being, we have the kinetic kill, the stun for the follow-up, and the sun strike right as soon as they're in the lane. We'll take down Irving and Sunil on the middle lane against the heroes. They have the curse, they have the root silence over to the invoke and arrow for the follow up. I guess I still keep you onto the middle lane, but it's only level 5 and Sunil who still falls into the hands of Undying. Undying. Or however you pronounce his name. Minus 2 in a gad for the invoke and now Gleams over the place, but he has saved him, so he's just gonna run away now. Stun over to, over to the Mirana with the hex for the follow up. Well, at least na ako naman tayo ng kill for Team Aster, pero XSS is in big trouble. Right click will be there for Phoenix. So, 2 heroes goes down for Team Aster, and that's 2 core heroes. Napaagi yung DP ni XSS in middle lane. He's only level 5. Understandable kung meron siyang primal speed, pero medyo short pa siya dito in terms of experience. Oh, Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Well, double star storm that could be enough. Short sighted of you. So looking at the current network, ticket pa rin naman. Overall, but still, uh, Mundi's could be farmed on his third blade, followed by Sumail. So, si XSS lang naman talaga yung uh, behind this team. Oi! Hi, Ki! Ano? Hey, Dazai. Grabe ka na. <laughs> Naglalaro ka pa ba? Wala na akong balita eh. Well, Hex, with the follow-up stun over to Phoenix, still has his Light of Fist and Remnants and Arrow will not connect for Imitator, but it doesn't matter. Kaha still goes down and the Sumi is still uh, pretty healthy. Phoenix has to TP out, stack to full HP, pero naman siyang Remnant on the middle lane. So, wala pa rin naman tayo nakikita ang successful na searing chains. Into arrow, pero yung power runes on the top lane this time. Still between this rune, which will be denied by the disruptor. Now gleams over to imitator. Gold snap attack. onto the silencer. I don't suppose you and the different targets, pero it's just heroes for team master. A gift from the tempest of battle. So a back to farming now. Let for team right. Anti mage forced to play on the jungle. Trying to farm his battle fury, but now gleams over to Irving. Metamorphosis is up for the third bleed. As all busy to the team right from his bande. EP agad, and meron na rin time vanguard for the two. Hi, Kiya Him. Magandang hapon, guys. Uh, Dyer's top tower is under attack. It's all the same to me. 
Radiant just fortified their structures. Well, once you go live for uh, Team Mass and when they will use Queen Gates onto the bottom lane, you can just use the Metamorphosis, take out this tier 1 bottom tower, pero on the middle lane. Jaha with the stun over to the silencer, we had the whole snap, turn, damage is there, plus the sun's like an excess. He doesn't need to commit his primal split, or maybe he does, or uh, never mind. And then, but in the menu, earn for the DPS. For tier 1, bottom tower down 2 will be on to XSS. Doesn't have any regen. We have the ice wall to slow them down, but it's not gonna do anything to help out XSS. And now Irving needs to run away, but we have the cold snap DP from Monet Reflection for the slow and reckless. And Irving to be taken down to so 2 euros goes down and it's need to point. And defend them and na Aster yung mid tower nila. And now was it in tier 1 bottom tower, so I think it still favors Aster. Problema lang talaga nila dito is hindi makahinga yung blue mass eh. Oh, Radiant's bottom tower is under attack! For the smoke play for uh, Team Bright, we have the Global Silence and they're trying to look for the Terror Blade. Because cool. I'm scattered already on the way. Arrow connects on to the real Terror Blade. Double damage from Phoenix and uh, Mune. One more life is to be enough. He goes down, we still have Phoenix here. Staying on the triangle, still has one remnant. No slight of this, remnants out, the exercise is right there waiting for him. Remnant onto the low ground and the finger of that onto the imitator. Support stand for both sides, but the exercise will try to chase out Phoenix and the exercise will be able to take out Phoenix and Undyne. Cold snap, right click from the Forge Spirit, 3 euro stand for Team Bright in exchange with those two. But do we go late for Team Master? Nakabawi naman sila with its smoke play from Team Bright. So until now, sobrang even pa rin naman yung game and for uh, the anti-mage, well, wala pa rin naman yung battle fury, pero medyo malapit na. Once na yung battle fury, makakasabay naman na siya sa farm ng terror blade. Pero ito yung pinagkaibahan nung uh, terror blade against AM. Parang yung terror blade, kung nakakasama siya sa mga team fights, you can push towers with the metamorphosis. Meanwhile, AM, parang papalo ka lang talaga ng creeps for the first 20 minutes. Kailangan mo muna makuha yung uh, Battle Fury and Manta style bago ka pwede yung sumama. Or actually, parang di ka pa rin sasama on the anti-mage. Mas gusto mo talaga pumalo ng creep. Push out some things. Time to finish. Well, our game will be taken by SSS and now Static Storm over to Phoenix and the Phoenix goes down. MLS will be used by the Glimpse over to the Silencer. We have the Hex, Rackets right will be there and two Euro goes down for Team Bright. Fortification still up for Team Bright. Pwede pa rin naman nalang itry, defend your mid tower. Get up on out of here because Radiant just fortified their structures. Uh, Dire's top tower is under attack. Radiant's middle tower is under attack! Radiant's middle tower is destroyed! He'd have eaten me if given half a chance. Radiant's middle tower is under attack! So for Gay Golden for Team Master, so he okay. still went for Midas, so wala ka talagang niya expect na galaw for Team Bright. But if you really stop for the anti mage and for the empire, it doesn't have to miss them yet. But it's more please for team master and uh, silencer is spotted, or maybe they're going for the bigger kill, trying to look for someone. But Irving might be safe. We have already been ward for the silencer, so expected naman yun na tong play for Aster. So mga wala yata sila mo huli with the smoke play. So um, for the anti mage still farming on the top team. Well, Blink Dagger is almost up for Kaka and for Sumil. 
Knight has together with Beach Fleet, Vanta Cell, Dragon, Lance, Predator, Fleet, and for XSS. Already has a Vessel and is going for a pipe on his next item. Illusion. Never refuse go. Have another. I insist. Well, here we, we had the disruption, but he's way too tanky and he's gonna be fine. Sun strike together with the finger of death and the gleam got a nice move from the silencer and here we will be safe. Gotta grab him, play the enemy gleam into sun strike. Perfect timing name for Aster, but in yala, kina pos lang talaga sila si damage. So Global Silence and Doom over the XSS arrow will miss, but it will connect on to Haka instead, but we still have the Silence and Doom for XSS. So XSS goes down next to the US from Imitator. Tama ba? Siya na lang yung mag aura items. We're team, right? And Dainy tried to go for the high ground, but as he's waiting for him, so he's getting crashed. Back to the go lead. But on the other hand, man, na habul dito in team red and for Phoenix, gonna be fine. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. A stun over the Irving K. He's looking for the follow up and the static storm. Irving should be the target again, but this time he will not survive this and the time is cast by the by the Milana rather. Uh, what a mess. This will be used to trap inside the kinetic field. We have the stun for the follow up. And with the tornado, Most might be another take down this Milana. So the Rose goes down again for Team Bright to uh, Aster. Patuli lang naman sila na hold it in the pickups. In they know no other global, no doom, so they're just being on their uh, oh, radiant spot of tower under attack. Being on the high ground and leave the tower down finally. So early radiant outpost control for us to only uh, 90 minutes fell na hole sila gan and leave the tower. But uh height naman na ganun, at least for uh, the anime still farming Steve on the top lane. Wala pa rin naman pressure na apply for the anti mage Parang hindi nga nagtatry yung Aster, no? Nahanapin yung AM Parang ini-ignore lang talaga nila Even though they know na nasa top lane lang siya nag-farm Parang yung doom yung lagi nilang Tinatarget with the stun, with the static storm Radiant's bottom tower is under attack! Oh, Radiant's middle tower is under attack! It's time! Well, it's 20 minutes and mga meron yata ang balak magraw siya niya. So we still have metamorphosis for money. So the Rosh went down to half HP and the mod will be going to team fight. So they'll try to go for this mid tower. 
the TV is already coming in from the disruptor and the remnant out now for the every skill. Oh, sila. Kaya ito paano. He just given to the third blade so back to farming lang ulit for team mass eh. Blade out lang ulit na another key item. Manta style for the invoker. So um, pwede hindi mo na yung scaddy for the blade. Without the scaddy, manta style is already up for the invoker. Pero other than that, wala na silang ibang item na yung team. They can go for another objectives. Well, uh, even later goes down to the hands of Kaka together with the uh, Sumit. So another big up secured for Team Master, but Team Fight. They want to go for this Tormentor and Shard of Fate will be given to the Mirana. Wala naman masyadong magandang Shard of Fate for the support of Team Fight. I think much better nga sana if yung silence yun na lang yung nakakuha para at least nakakuha pa siya ng in. Radiant's top tower has fallen! Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack. Oh, Radiant's top tower is destroyed. Oh, boy. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack. Whoa, Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. It's time for the high ground push Radiant, Muli with Alakasi Aegis is still up For a team list and I don't connect on to your ring Static Storm sounds like it's time for the follow up from Gaka But Finger Flat still on cooldown for 1 minute Gaka is way too deep The Global Silence will be used Rakshis over to the Lion and dip forward for Imitator and I don't connect On to Exorcist instead But Gaka will still survive Dyer's bottom tower is under attack so, and dito pa rin naman yung DD Tower, good defense for uh, Team Bright and the Metamorphosis, malapit na rin naman mag-expire. So, mukhang maghihintay na naman yata tayo na another Metamorphosis for Team Master and by the time na meron sila meta, mag-expire na rin yung Aegis. So, uh, medyo risky yung ganun, pero 2 way go lead for Aster, nakahabol na talaga. I, I mean, 23 minutes na siyang pumapalo lang talaga ng clips. Hindi pa natin nakikita yung AM. Pero, gaya nga nasabi ko, even though you have Battle Fury and Manta style, hindi pa rin yun enough for the anti beast para sa mga manan fight. So, he's going for a BKB. Not sure if itutuloy niya ba to. Pero BKB is the must talaga against the Disruptor. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack! Oh boy, Dyer's bottom tower is getting hit. Well, Hex over to Irving and stun for the follow up, but on oh, the silence instead, it's Irving will pop the BGB go for XSS. Doom is there and Phoenix with the BGB going for the support on the back lines and XSS. Still in big trouble and Monique is going for the night now. Antimage is finally ready to join the team fight together with his BGB. Kaha goes down and Monique doesn't have any mana left but still has the Aegis. Buyback will be used by Siamis Cat. If he's onto the middle lane and Monique doesn't have any mana, he can go for mana void if he wants. Pero mukha nga iiwan na lang nilang buhay dito yung uh, third plate. Yung waste of resources din kung papatay nila yung third plate. I think they're happy with that one. Taking out three heroes and the first five back on the disruptor. So 14, 18 at 25 minutes back to even game. And the uh, anti-mage now leading in terms of networks so after BEB. To go for ice scaddy. Pero ito na yung time na pwede nang sumami yung AM. Like you have two defensive items and Biggie bilang naman talaga yung kailangan niya para itong magandang team fight.
take a few more of those. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Oh, man! Uh, Dyer's top tower is under attack. Illusion. Might as well have shot enough. We slip into shadow. <coughs> I just go in the bun, guys. I'm like, sorry. <laughs> Well, Monet gets caught, we have to do Mano for the follow-up and I'm gonna make sure to be giving Mano for the Monet goes down huge big up and Gaha will be the next target he said for Team Master and he's gonna heart heart but off the go heart out I'm from Alnia now Static Storm will be dropped over to a Phoenix he doesn't have the BGB but the Lama time will give follow-up damage and nice arrow from Imitator connecting over to Sumir and Vitarax that's Hero said for Team Master and now we have the Sticky go did for this guy I think na hit naman nandito ng mga team bright yung timing nila And uh, for team master, I mean maganda naman yung naging early nila Pero this time, parang team bright slowly recovering for this team Parang na even, I mean na, uh, meron pa rin naman tayong tier 2 towers for Aston Ayun yung maganda dun Mas malaki pa rin yung map control na meron yung Aster Pero yung Roshan Next round shot, it's gonna be a crucial for both sides, but then the imitator gets caught. Have the stun hex for the follow up. It's trapped inside the kinetic field, try to leap out and TP out, but he still has the glimpse for the hands, and the imitator will be taken out. So, um, this is ruin long, he's not going to be So five minutes move please for uh, Team Bright, Roshan is finally up, so it favors Team Bright the man since it's daytime. Bays in mystic light. And then for any uh, outpost, uh, they can react. Even with the buyback, the Ruby goes in, boom over. The Mane, but he pops the BGB in time and now he'll try to go for the TP out. Back to safety with a time for Hansen and TP for Team Bright. But on the other side, Kaha gets the heck over to. um. Amber Spirit, well, Gaha still goes now, but he goes for Phoenix, but he does have the buyback, but one for one as of now, but Team Bright, I think they need to disengage for this team fight. Global Science already used, now Gleams onto the Silencer, for Staff onto the Cliff, but he doesn't have the TP, and Gaha still trying to look for someone with his buyback, but in lang, that's it for them. So, two for one, and a buyback again for the support of Team Master.
Kung hindi siguro na pag bibi dun si Monday, dun pwedeng maluge yung uh, team bright. I mean, uh, I mean, uh, dun sana sila pwede pala makabaw eh. Pero buti na lang nakapag-react naman dito. Yung uh, third blade. Yun yung maganda sa doom eh. Hindi na namimute yung item. So pagka BKB niya, ala, nakapag-TP out lang din siya. Kahit pala maunahan sila ng doom, doesn't matter. Pwede ka pa rin pala may BKB. Level 25 pa yun. BKB TP out, parang kakailangan mo pa ng basher on the game para mapigilan yung ganong instances na pwede mag BKB TP out lang for two. Oh man, looks like the tire got to Roshan just a little bit before everybody else could. Well, another tormentor for Team Bright, and this time, Shardok Raid will be given to the Silencer. Meron na bang Shard yung Corpus nila? Well, meron na yung Ember, wala tayo sa Doom. Hindi naman ganun kaganda yung, uh... Shard of Raid, only si Rus. Radiant's Middle Tower is under attack! So we still have the Aegis and Cheese for uh, Team Master. Medyo matagal-tagal pa rin naman ni Aegis. So another high ground defense for Team I'm Type. Yung kailan nilang gawin? Radiant's middle tower is under attack! The ruin of regeneration! Oh, Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Jeez, Radiant's middle tower just got wrecked. The primal speed will be used for XSS. This is some damage on the star, but global science will be used and the uh, ADM goes in. But we have the tornado for the control and Monet's We're low on HP, Remnant's in for Phoenix and Monet. Who stands to has the AD. Still has his speed, and the BKB will be used to over to the third wave. But we have the basher from the anti mage, and ayun na nga yung pang concept na BP out, and Monet will be taken out with his death for the master. Make it three bit to root over the time. It's kind of too good for the anti mage. So good high ground defense for Team Bright. Wala naman tayong mauko on tower turn for Aster. I mean, almost. Pero another attempt yun on the high ground with the Aegis. And hindi naman siya nag-work out. Well, 7k golded for Team Bright. That this is not doing good for Aster. Oh boy, Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Dyer's middle tower just took a big beating. It's gone. Well, the NATO EMP sinks out, but it's way too late. Gonna burn off. Then, when you're mad, you're an anti mage, but still. 
Lapa rin tayo ng lead for 5 seconds. So, una pang makakabasa ng DD Tower and Team Red, but they need to back off Metamorphosis. Still on cooldown for Team Master. Pero wala rin naman tayong spells for Team Bright. You need to wait out your doom. Same goes for Global Silence. So, ba? Safe na lang ulit. Doesn't matter kahit hindi na huwa ng Rosa yung Team Bright. As long as na-defend nila yung high ground, dun sila nakakabawi. Haste! So smoke play for uh, Team Bright. The five minutes for completed the last nine spells. So they're just looking for some target. They don't have any vision on the triangle, but we have the ward for Imitator. Flash Sentry gets the ward after they have the idea. Oh, Radiant's bottom tower is under so attack. So they're just gonna back away. <sighs> oh, Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Their team right looks like they want to force this high ground. You don't need to be worried about sightings since they defend the man. Na. Nung... Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> <Every attack. spirit. laughs> oh, first oh, set no, of no, rocks taken. Just range for now, no, but. Um, Man, this style blinks out. Radiant Tower is under attack. Oh, Radiant's bottom 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 tower is under attack. Para at least mga laban na sila, di ba? Yung medyo nahihirapan na sila. Wala, medyo hirap na hirap na sila. Kasi dalawang teamfight na, natatalo yung team master. And dun sa dalawang teamfight na yun, naka-team wipe pa yung team bright. Radiant's middle tower is under attack! Man, you might as well save that energy because Radiant just fortified their structures! Invisibility! So, Roshan will be up in 1 minute and 38 seconds, so we have turned Roshan. Well, two Roshans, Aster, they already know what they're doing, but even with the Aegis, they're going to be able to push the high ground. So maybe with the third Roshan, they can, but it's going to be late time, so that's the best thing they can get. Works out well for both sides, but Team Bright this time, they're not going to be able to get the high ground. They're going to give the Roshan just the same. And they are in a good position to contest for this rush, but one minute for Roshan. Thank you. 
hidden, even from the oh god, there's both remnants. Gaha gets cancelled. And Doom over the exercise. That is time for the follow up connecting on the Doom heroes. They have Dagger and Scepter and Anti Magician in Victor, but we had the four stop for the save. He's gonna be fine. Same goes for Phoenix. Pops the BKB and now he goes for the Remnant Exorcist will still be taken down but Anthony is taken back onto this team fight. Disarm over to the Fairy Blade and to start to run with another play from the EM but he'll be taken out still has his buyback. And now buyback committed for the Anthony. Same goes for Sumail and Exorcist. Can't side onto Irvin but he's still safe for now and Simon is got his trap. I mean he has a kinetic field but Sumail has to uh, disconnect for some reason. <laughs> So, uh, pwede muna tayo mag-isip for Team Blight, pero I'm pretty sure na mamamatay na dito yung Disruptor XSS was back for this team fight. I mean, they can still try to fight since meron pa siyang uh, Primal Split. So, siya kasi agad yung nadali dito. Right, even with the Lincoln Spear, I think aware naman yata yung Team Blight. Meron tayong Halberd to uh, cancel the Lincoln. Now we're finally back to the game and the Yuna has hearing chains over to the Disruptor and that's the Euro step for Team Master. Little left who committed buyback for this team fight. Primal Split already used by XSS. So there's no way na pwede nila contest dito yung Roshan which will be up in 10 seconds pero Team Bright looks like they want to continue the push. Uh, I mean, who Roshan, Roshan? Lekta na to. Tier 3 tower. I mean, even though there's a buyback on the third bleed, it's not gonna commit the buyback. Wala oh, siyang metamorphosis. So, wala rin siyang gagawin, kahit na meron siyang buyback. Pero Roshan spotted. Wisdom rune taken by the silencers. So, mukha mag-Roshan muna yata. Dito yung team, right? Double and they even have the double damage. So, mapabot yung game for team, right? I mean, even though mabuhay si Mune, Primal Split still on cooldown, so easy rush na to for team, right? Agarin's blessing, not sure uh, kind of a bagay. Maybe sa anti so arang okay lang din. Link fragment, it does a lot. You can easily catch your backline. Pero naman na tayo Agarin's scepter for the Ember. Hindi din naman ganun ka valuable yung Agarin for, uh, for Irvi. Oh, oh, so, so AJ's blessing given to the anti you still have the cheese. Ayo lang who oh, will be taken by the silencer. So 23k golded for uh, Team Bright. Fresh AJ's no buyback for Sumil and for XSS. So do you need to be Is careful about this one? A gift from the Tempest of Battle! Only the wary might find us. Imba strength now rekindled. So MLS for a team bright, but uh, Aster they're just sitting on their high ground. Walang makalabas ng B. I mean they still have the vision on the top side jungle, pero yun lang yun natatangin B for this game. So very risky if lalabas din sila ng mapa. So I think, eto yung uh, moment na di nasipan mahabawi sa game yung high ground B. Which is 
ganun yung ginagawa niya ng team right so uh, kapitan dan naman siya dito ng sitwasyon Tyrus Metal Barracks are getting plunged into a sea of abuse. Tyrus Metal Barracks are. Well, first set of rounds taken by Team Tide, but the fight is finally up. For the anti mage. So, we'll have to end the game for Muni. Well, Arrow will not connect, but Phoenix is staying with his Lemsa Stun and Hex over to the anti mage, but it's way too tanky. Metamorphosis tracks over to the AM, but he still has the EG, so he's gonna be fine. And Doom will be used on to Mune, but that's Doom and Global Silence use Hex. Over to Irving, Metamorphosis still up. So, one do better when you damage for Mune. So, Irving goes down, still has his buyback. Now, in this pop for Phoenix, he needs to run away. But the Hex from Sumail, Static Storm will be dropped. He can't use his, uh, any items because of this Static Storm, but the mana void takes out time, his cat, and, uh, any attack. Went for the blink in, still has the Aegis, and Mune. Trying to run away with the bash stun from Kaha over to the anti mage, but we still have the control on Mune. Goes for the buyback, but it doesn't have the metamorphosis, so Mune goes down for 100 seconds. No buyback as well, and Aegis is still up for the anti mage. The fortification will be used. Anti mage so will be taken out finally, but still has the Aegis, so he's gonna be back to full HP. So another set of frags taken and Ooh, looks like it's gonna be mega quick. Yeah. It's sobrang possible even it's without Doom, game. even without Global Silence. Well, well, dodge. Yeah, right yeah, right dodge. Si Idol. Pero okay lang yan. Well now we're gonna rock city yung uh, Aster thanks to the Cliffs but Phoenix will just go for the TPS still has the remnants to get back on his defense but the Global Sands will be used and Gaha gets caught they have the arrow but Gaha still has the buyback Primal Split is on cooldown for 50 seconds so that's still a lot of time na kailangan hintayin ng team as and now Glimpse over to the anti-mage hex for the follow up first link fragment over to Mune and the anti-mage will focus on to this last set of frags and mega clips secured already for team right possible for Mega Clips comeback. Parang medyo mahirap eh, no? Pero Static Storm will be dropped onto the Mirana pero wala namang kasi masyadong damage yung Static Storm. Yun yung problema dyan sa spell na yan. Even though matagal yung duration niya. So, uh, masasurvive pa rin naman yung Imitator. So, it's gonna be back. Back to safety lang, boss. So, uh, wala na tayo nakikita ang buyback, no? Well, magkakaroon naman na ng buyback sa Excess as in goes for uh, Sumail. Pero magkakabuyback rin yung AM. In case we can have another team fight, but Aster, they are not going to be able to get out of the base. But now, they don't have to get out of the base against Mega Creep. They are not even decent to their hero in clearing out the Creep Wave, like your support is just Lion and then Raptor. They are not too much. They are just a single target. They have the Aster. Well, Shard of Blade will be given to um, the Anti-Mage. So, spell damage reduction to, diba? Or, ay, binago na pala. Counter spell ally. Ah, uh, extra spell for the Anti-Mage. So, imagine, meron ka ng Blink Fragment, meron ka pang counter spell ally. So, 3 seconds cooldown, no? pwede mo siyang gamitin anytime. On your teammate, siguro pwede sa 2. Siya naman yung pumapasok lagi, or maybe dun sa Ember Spirit, pero it's a 4 months smoke play for a team bright. Shield rune. 
on the top lane will be taken by Phoenix to a 3-5 HP. Kalahatiin mo. Ang laking uh, rune yan. I mean, ang laking shield for the Embers. It's almost 5k HP. But Smoke will break Kaha goes in with the blade, but Global Science will be used. We have any detection, but Kaha is trying to run away, but a remnant is for Phoenix. Global Science will be used and BGB pop for the anti mage but a Doom on the back lines is over to Sumila. He can't do anything, might avoid and to mail down. He doesn't have the buyback there with for Mune, but it's not gonna hit anyone. And the uh, time scout will be taken out as well. Kaha with the mana team, but doesn't have any mana left. And Mune is trying to fight against Irving, but now he doesn't have any mana left. Primal is not gonna help out the Terry Blade. And DP has been called finally. Team 1 will be taken by Team Riot in a best of three series against Team Aster. Well, one win a week for Team Riot to advance for this lower bracket, and one lose away for Team Aster to get eliminated for this TI qualifiers. And the uh, grabe yung habak na ginawa dito ng Team Riot. Even though hindi naman ganun kalamang talaga yung uh, Team Aster pero early stages ng game. I mean, uh, Aster, they had the control. Nakuha sila ng early towers. Pero for Team Riot, parang ganun lang ginawa. Just give space for the anti-mage. Parang, di ba, almost 30 minutes siya nagpa-farm lang. Freely na. Wala talaga ang katret-tret for the anti-mage. Like, we didn't have any smoke lift for Team Aster to look for the zero. Instead, yung doom yung palagi nilang binibigyan. And... I mean, uh, understandable, as long as nakakakuha yun ng kill for Team Aster, as nakakuha kayo ng golden experience, pero yung anti-mage talaga yung maging problema nila for this game. And ayun na nga yung nangyari. Masyado nang mayaman yung anti-mage pag sama nyo yung team fight with his BKB, which is nag-workout naman, yung third item BKB. Once na nakuha nyo yung BKB, parang Team Aster, hindi na sila nakalaban talaga. Lagi sila nauna with the global, yung way you control na meron yung team right. And, uh, tignan natin kung makakabaya ba yung Team Aster for our game number 2. So, magkakaroon lang tayo ng 5 to 10 minutes short break. And, kita-kits for the next game.